Yeah, I think the pizza lineup on Italian Day is going to be pretty long. It looked like a nice day on the drive yesterday, and uh, you know we might uh, do just as well this afternoon, Kyle, with a lot of cloud cover uh, smothering the south coast right now. But the day is young. At this time of year, we often get the cloudy mornings and then the more pleasant, sunnier afternoons, and that's what it looks like. No rain on the radar, but clouds pretty much covering the entire district so far. When we look at the big scale satellite picture. There's no wet weather maker out there. The next one's a long ways off. Now it does close in for the second half of this week. Things really cool down. They turn unsettled again. But hey, let's uh, focus on the short term forecast, which is somewhat more optimistic starting in the Fraser Valley. Right now it's mostly cloudy. It stays that way through noontime, but gradually clearing up for a temperature above the 20 degree mark this afternoon. Clouds are back tonight. And for Metro Vancouver, I think the clearing trend gets underway a little more quickly than that. We'll see some holes in the cloud cover by noontime. And then to wrap up the afternoon, really trending sunnier, 20, maybe 21 degrees for a high downtown. Tomorrow, it's a similar pattern, but there may be a sprinkle or two in the morning, adding in a small chance of morning showers, then steadily clearing just a little in the afternoon. Look at that longer range trend. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, that's unseasonably cool. We have an increasing chance of rain in the forecast. It gets us through the end of the week. That might be the end of it, though, with the uh, promise of some sunshine back in the weekend forecast and temperatures back in the 20s. Although I'd say for the next few days, not looking great starting Wednesday. Thor, good morning to you. It's only a Monday so far. We'll enjoy this one. Yeah, I was going to say, not too much of a silver lining there, but uh, I guess we'll hold out to the weekend. Yeah.